Hey guys, and welcome back again to Let's Play Golden Sun. I am sorry for taking forever to get this next episode out. I kind of got sidetracked. Well, maybe not kind of. I got very sidetracked with the new game. I got uh, Star Wars The Old Republic, and that's been pretty much keeping my time for this past month or so. Um, it's really fun. I won't get too much into it though. But here we are in the village of Kolama. If you remember that uh, last time we discovered that there was a, a curse that had turned a person into trees, into a tree, and apparently it turned this entire village into trees. And if you remember, it's because they tried to cut down Tret, the holy tree. So he cursed them all. What is it now, Ivan? That's sparkly stuff on the ground. What is it? Oh. Ooh, yeah. That's not cool. Uh oh. Maybe that's what turned everybody into trees. Something happens. And those little spheres protect them. Isaac, what just happened to us? Did the barrier it saved us? I think so too, Isaac. I don't- I think I know what those domes were. It was our synergy. What are you, crazy? I didn't use any synergy. Hey, I can stand. I can move again. I think it's okay. Go ahead. Stand up. Huh. Those barriers! We thought that cider tube was only used when we concentrate, right? When I was training, I'd focus so hard I thought my head would burst. Well, maybe it's just easier for you, but when I use synergy... Anyway, I'm certain that was synergy we were projecting. That must mean that some synergy acts only when it's needed. You mean like when we're in danger? I think it's like when we strike critical hits in battle. We can't control it, but it's there when we need it. I can agree with what Garrett is saying. It's definitely possible. Wouldn't it be cool if we could use this power at any time, Isaac? And you know what, guys? This is like the only time in the game where something like this happens. Never again will they reference this synergy or synergy acting all by itself or anything like that. I mean, you don't even see this dome synergy. Unless you, it counts as like, I don't know, one of Garrett's defensive spells or something. But now you see the two holy trees are talking. That one's Laurel. And the one with the angry face is Tret. Huh. 
So this situation is even more dire than we thought. Isaac, isn't there anything we can do? What can we do? Do you have an idea? Looks like Isaac has something in mind. We'll leave it up to you, Isaac. Let's go save everyone. Alright, so first, before we go save everyone, here's a couple things we want to grab here in town. Uh, not that many, but I can't remember where everything is. There's a few stray items in pots, and something more important. There we go. And yeah, all those trees used to be people. Also, FYI, I have a new mic now, and uh, this is pretty much the first time I tried using it, so I'm still trying to learn how to get it to work right and record properly and stuff, so uh, bear with me if my, uh, my dialogue or commentary didn't exactly uh, sound right. Okay, so we got an apple, give it to Ivan, make him stronger. And, uh, you probably saw that guy down there yet. That, uh, Jin. Oh, let's go get him. Sneaky back door behind the house. Travel through this little cave. Oh, right. So let's see what Jupiter looks like. Cool. And we're almost around. I don't know why they have this huge cave underneath their house just so they can get to the backyard. Alright, granite. That one is pretty useful. It creates a barrier that, um, it, uh, kind of negates how much damage you take, which is very, very nice. And it will be very useful during, uh, boss fights. Finally, that thing goes down. I don't know why rats are so hard to kill. And Isaac's running out of synergy. Alright, Ivan levels up. Okay, finally. So I think there's a couple more things to get maybe, I don't remember. But that gin and that apple were pretty much the main things. Oh, 
Oh, you got some money? there's anything in these people's house. So one more house to check, and then we can go on to Column of Woods. Alright. Let's go to Column of Woods! So this is pretty much, yeah, new enemies, Ooh, oh, 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 there went there, oh, nice one, that uh, howling smash thing Ivan did, that was from his weapon, that uh, what is it, bandit sword I think, yeah, so pretty much this place is kind of a maze, a maze with Ran there he goes again. Random battles. Alright, Isaac levels. It's a pretty easy maze. I mean, it's straightforward and nothing really too difficult to figure out. Of course, uh, i played this game so many times already, so it seems easy to me. But really, this is like, well, it's not the first dungeon you go through, but it's still at the beginning of the game. Kinda. So, we're getting closer to the halfway point. We're making rather good progress. But at least I think it's the halfway point. I call it the halfway point, because it's like, the first... Like, after this dungeon, or not dungeon, after this forest, the next, um, dungeon-like place you go in is one of the major dungeons in the game. There's two of them and that would be the first one. So I'm gonna start having Isaac use his gin since he's running out of synergy power. That should help him attack still and do decent damage. The other two here and Ivan are doing fine. I know that Howling Smash doesn't look like it does too much, but later weapons you get do cooler stuff and sometimes have additional effects like... Well, you'll find out when we get the weapons. As you can see, there's a lot of log pushing in this particular maze. In this next area... Well... Yeah... Let's use granite. Or granite, whatever. Clear wall. Oh, right, he's got the next powerful one. Seize the shield. And in the next battle, I'll probably show you guys what summoning two Jin do. Okay, you can summon both flint and granite at the same time. And then it'll just make an even cooler summon. So see that chest up there? We want to get that chest. And to do that, we have to hit the switch. That sign over there, by the way, tells you not to hit the switch, but you kind of have to in order to get farther, so it's okay. So we want to 
push that one down here. Then we want to push this one over here. And this is to get the chest. We'll have to do a different combination later to get farther into the forest. Alright. So we go back up here. And we should be able to hop across the logs to get to the chest. It should be a fur coat. Let's give that to Ivan. I think he will probably need it more. Yep. Give it to him. And I think that fur coat has an additional defensive ability that it um, protects you from, what is it, water damage, I think? I don't remember. But in order to get farther, I have to drain this again. And then this next one, it, it's really simple what you gotta do to get farther. Just push those two up and push the one to the far right all the way over then you're gonna have to push the top left one down and push the far left one to the right I think, well no, actually you do it to the left cause then you won't be able to jump over it if it's too far Okay. So I do believe after we go up here we might... Yes, there's Laurel. Oh, you are the ones who resisted Tret's glamour. I sense a great warmth within you. If you came to rescue Tret, you are already too late. Soon Tret will die, and we shall wither away without him. Leave now before this forest is destroyed. No, nope. Chick Desta. There's Tret. He won't say anything. Oh, well, never mind. I control all in Tret's realm. Oh, well. I was- oh, yes, 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 let's summon two Jin Ramses. You need two, uh, Venus Jin in order to summon him. Punch! Yep, that was pretty cool. So, let's just finish this guy off. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we're going to stop here for now. And, um, next time we'll be back. We will travel inside Tret to see if we can free him from this evil that is within. Are you guys ready? I know I am. See you later.